Welcome all. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, how to scroll the web page up and down using Selenium WebDriver. Let me answer. In Selenium WebDriver, if you want to scroll the web page up and down, then we have to run some JavaScript code, guys, which is only possible using this predefined interface of Selenium, that is JavaScript executor. And it has a predefined method known as execute script. So by using this command, we can run the JavaScript code, which will allow us to scroll the web page up and down. Now let me practically show you how to do this. Here is some sample Selenium automation code, guys, which will open the Chrome browser, maximize the browser, and it will take you to this application URL. Like this, guys. In the Chrome browser, it will take you to this application URL. Once you are taken to this application URL, we want to scroll this page down. Okay. We want to scroll this page down first. After a while, we want to scroll this up. So how to do this? For that, we have to run some JavaScript code. Okay, in this Selenium automation code, we need to run some, we need to run the JavaScript code for scrolling the page up and down, fine. Let's first uh, scroll the page down. Later, we'll scroll it up. So, in order to run that JavaScript code, what is the interface, guys? The interface is nothing but the JavaScript executor. So what we'll do is we'll cast this driver, object of this web driver with that JavaScript executor interface. So first I'll write the driver and I will cast this driver with the, with what, guys? JavaScript executor. Once the driver is casted here, I'll create a variable like this, JSC, hover the mouse on JSC and say create local variable. Now hover the mouse on JavaScript uh, interface, JavaScript executor interface and import this interface from the Selenium like this. Now using the predefined method of this JavaScript executor interface that is execute script. Okay, by using this command, we can run the JavaScript code. Here, instead of these two parameters, I'll make it one and I'll provide this double quotes inside this execute script. And here, what, what JavaScript code we have to provide. For that guys, let me show you right click somewhere on the page and inspect and go to the console tab and clear this stuff. Here we got the console. Here I will type window dot, okay? Scrolling scrolling up and down is something related to window, right? So we have to say window dot scroll, okay? Just scroll. There's a command known as scroll by. So this is the command guys. Here in this command, we have to provide two values. You see X and Y values we have to provide. First value is, this is horizontal guys, okay? First parameter. First parameter belongs to the horizontal scrolling. We want to scroll vertically, right? So we can put it as zero. And the second parameter is Y, which is vertical scrolling. For vertical scrolling, what is the, uh, what is the amount you want to scroll? You have to provide that. For example, I want to scroll by some 400, okay? 400. Now copy this line and paste into the JavaScript executor. Execute, com execute script command of the JavaScript executor will paste this line. That's it, okay? So if you run this code, guys, the page will scroll down, guys, okay? The page will scroll down. Let me show you. So uh, just to make the difference, I'll add some thread dot sleep, guys, so that you can see the difference. Like initially, the page will be at a proper position. After that, uh, after some three seconds, after three seconds, you see the page will scroll down. Run it. As you can see now, the application has opened. And by default, you see the scroll bar is here. After three seconds, you see it got scrolled down automatically. Now I want to scroll up. Okay, I want to scroll up. So what I have to do, again, I'll add some thread dot slip here, just for the demo purpose. And again, I'll use the same object reference of this JavaScript executor interface and call the same execute script command, or you can copy this one also, okay? Anything is fine. Here, in order to scroll up, we have to give minus, let's say I want to scroll up by 200. I scroll down by 400. I want to scroll up by 200. That's why I gave negative value. Negative value means it will go up. Positive means it will go down. Fine. Now let me run the code. I'll close this and run the code. By running this JavaScript code here, for scrolling down and up, you are able to scroll the web page. Right? You see, initially, the scroll bar is at the proper position. You see, it scrolled by 400. After three seconds, scrolled up by 200 seconds. So 
So hope guys, you got the answer for this interview question. That is how to scroll the web page up and down using Selenium WebDriver. That is, we have to use, we have to use the JavaScript executor interface and the execute script command for running the JavaScript code, which will scroll the web page up and down. Fine. So that's it guys. Thank you. Bye.